hello everyone and welcome back to my channel my name is daisy for those who don't know me and those who are returning thank you so much for your support i ask you that if you find this video fun entertaining in any way give me a thumbs up click the notification bell and don't leave today without subscribing to my channel thank you so much so today in this video i wanted to tag myself in this trend that i've been seeing on youtube about the five best bags for every day i have bags that fall into each of these categories so i wanted to share with you what are those for me this video has five categories which are number one uh, the best everyday bag number two the best work bag number three the best rainy day bag number four the best fun vacation bag and number five the best date night bag if this is something that you find entertaining or you think you're gonna like this video then keep on watching and let's find out which bags did i put in each category or maybe two bags So like I said, this video has been trending on here on YouTube and I have many bags that I love for every day, for rainy days, for work days, for a vacation and also for date nights. So I thought, let me make this video and get on trend with this that's going around the tube. So for the first category of the everyday or the best everyday bag, in my opinion, out of my collection, I think with no doubt whatsoever would be the Pochette Matisse. Okay, if this bag is very on trend. This bag, you can use it for every day, meaning that um, I can fit in this bag all my essentials, everything I need for the whole day. And the good thing about this bag is that it has a strap that you can cross body that you can use over your shoulder you can also remove this strap carry a top handle and this is such an easy bag to match with anything you're wearing throughout the day whether it's jeans or a dress or shorts sneakers and whatnot you can use this very casually as well as take off the strap and carry her top handle for a night out or out to dinner or anything like that so that's why i put this in the category of the best everyday bag this is a gorgeous gorgeous bag and let me tell you that i continue to say this in every video when i first saw this bag it was not one of my favorites and for some reason in the short amount of time that i have her she has become my everyday bag and one of my top favorite bags the pochette matisse so category two the best work bag and in my opinion i think a tote bag would definitely be a top work bag so in my case i chose the tote bag by mark jacobs in the dusty rose color in the leather small size now that was a mouthful <laughs> so this bag i think it's a very good work bag because in this bag although it's considered the small size you can fit plenty of your work things in here if you need an ipad if you can even probably uh fit a small, small laptop and all of that and even in the medium tote bag which is the canvas material i'll put a picture right here and i'll also insert the video that i did of that bag here but i think it's so versatile and me being a lover of pink i think this is the one that i consider very excellent very functional bag for work due to the fact that although it's small she can fit a lot of things in here okay so that is the one that i chose for the category of the best work bag all right category three for the best rainy day bag I know that this will not surprise many of you if you own this bag. And in my case, 
the bag I chose for this. The Damier Ebene Speedy 25 from Louis Vuitton. And you probably know the reason why I chose this one. This is definitely a bag that I consider to be water resistant in every way because I've been caught in the rain with this bag plenty of times. And all I literally do is grab a tissue, wipe her down, and she comes out exactly the same way that she was prior to getting wet because this is a treated leather on the handles. She has treated leather on the sides. This is a canvas material which the water does not penetrate through. It slides off and the same with the treated uh, vachetta on the top. And as long as she is closed up, you won't get water in her. So this hands down the best bag you can use on a rainy day especially here in Florida that you can be out in the beautiful Florida weather and all of a sudden a downpour so I've been caught in that and I definitely recommend having a canvas bag for the best bag for a rainy day and especially if you get her with a treated leather because the vachetta leather will of course uh, get uh, stains from the raindrops but this at all I think this bag is so beautiful in every way and she is the best rainy day bag. Okay. Category number four, the best fun vacation bag. So in this category, I had to pick two bags. I couldn't decide between one and the other and I'll explain the reason why. I think going on vacation, this bag is the best bag I can take on vacation. I think she is so adorable and this is the Crozette in the Damier Azure print from Louis Vuitton. I think this is a beautiful vacation bag. I think this bag goes with everything you wear. I, like I've said before, this is a bag that I can use in the summer, spring, fall, and winter. So if you're going on vacation anywhere, you can take this bag, although in the rain and in the snow, this is a very difficult bag to wear because she can stain because of the vachetta leather. But at the same time, I think this is such a lightweight bag, easy to carry, top, top handle, as well as crossbody or on the shoulder. Also, you can fit in here very little, which is what you want for a vacation bag. You don't want to be carrying with a whole book bag of, or a whole tote um, to carry on vacation. And I think this one is perfect size for an everyday resort or a cruise or a, anywhere, I think. That's my opinion. So I would recommend and I would categorize this as one of my best fun vacation bags for sure. I had to choose a second bag for this category and maybe for you it's not a bag but I made it into a bag and that would be the pochette that goes with the Neverfull. And the reason why I chose this one, I did some alterations on mine. And so now I'm able to carry her like this. I can put her here as a clutch. And I this is beautiful for nighttime, for daytime, for anything that you are on vacation for my cruise. I took a bag, a regular bag, and then I also took this. And that's where I did the alterations, as you can see. I added onto her a clip or a D-ring and made her uh, so that I can crossbody her with a strap from here to here where she has 
her the other d ring or i can use her like this or i can use her as a um clutch which usually everybody does and i also added a very very pretty little chain in the front and all that so this carries enough when you're on vacation like your passport you can take in here a wallet a small wallet or a card holder a lip gloss a lipstick a uh, compact a mirror or something like that that you would need so I think that these um, pochettes or clutchettes or clutches are perfect perfect for a fun vacation time and you can even accessorize her and do whatnot so she could look a little more prettier so ladies if you own one of these I recommend for you to make this alteration so you'll be able to use her as a crossbody but I think this is a perfect and fun vacation bag. One of the best. Okay. Now for my fifth and last category would be the best date night bag. And in this case, again, I couldn't choose one, but I chose two. And with no surprise to anyone, <laughs> the Speedy 20 in the monogram and she has her strap in here and everybody knows i'll put a picture right here what the strap looks like i think this is the best tiniest little bag and adorable bag for a perfect date night bag i've used her for that i used her on my birthday i've used her out for dinner and she is very compact but she packs a punch she carries what i exactly what i need even my phone so in here i would put my phone a compact lipstick lip gloss no keys if i'm going of course on a date with my husband so everything i need fits in here perfectly she is comfortable to carry she is top handle which personally i love and if i wanted to do a crossbody or a over the shoulder i just add a strap whether it's the strap she comes with or any other strap that i want to use that night so best best number one date night bag would be the speedy 20 now my second best date night bag if you know and you see my videos you're gonna know exactly what bag it is and it is the soft side trunk hands down the best for date night this is a lightweight bag that looks beautiful looks like you're wearing jewelry and that's something that i'm going to continue to say about her my son said she looks like a piece of jewelry and he's exactly right and i think this is the best bag just going out you know in the night in town and taking her for walks in a city walk or to the movies even uh dinner um this is the perfect bag for date night so these are the bags that i think in my opinion or in my collection that i think are fall in each of those categories so i'm gonna end the video here and i thank you if you stood until the end to watch this video and if you did i ask you that if you found it fun entertaining in any way click the notification bell thumbs up and don't leave today without subscribing to my channel god bless you god keep you and until my next video ciao Espanol. Great. Why are you so happy? Okay, I need, I'm recording, so yeah, I love you. All right. Mommy, I love you, but I'm recording. Stay over there. <laughs>